you how to out whistle. Um, I did this video before on it was either on this channel or another channel. All right. So what you do is like clap your hands. Some people do this, but th I like this way. And then so so, so it's like you're clapping, and have your thumbs positioned like this. And if you if you know if you hear that it's not um that it's not going to it's, if it's not making a noise try bringing your thumbs together oh and a lot of people um blow like this that's not how you do it you blow at your knuckles so. It would do, you hear that noise. <laughs> now, um, a lot of people, a lot of people think that it's an actual owl. I tried, I tried to do this noise, and, like, when there is an owl around. It did, but that was before I, I do. I I just did. Hoo, hoo. I did that, uh -huh. and yeah. But and to change how it sounds, like change, change the pitch. <coughs> Bring your hands closer together. Would make, that would make it um higher. And, um, it's going to be lower when your hands are further apart. It feel a little lightheaded now. And then the second way is this. So you do the same thing. But I don't know this way, so it takes a while. pause I'm very lightheaded okay there so and also to, um there's another way to change the pitch so um open the back part of your hand like that I'm lightheaded again Okay, so now, um, and you can do this. And also this. Now, opening your hand this way won't change the pitch that much. See? So it's just better to do. And it sounds like an owl. So that's pretty much it. it. The last part is that you can change the pitch by opening your hands like that. I don't know how to do this part, so. See what they're doing. Yeah. Okay, that's about it. I'm very lightheaded. I feel sick now. So, goodbye.